Karen, we're standing here on the first day of the Transformation in a Changing Climate Conference in Oslo, and you're one of the initiators of the conference. So can you tell me a bit about the ideas behind the conference? Yeah, the ideas actually came up from a group of people who are interested in like what do we do to respond to the global challenges like climate change, like biodiversity mm -hmm. loss um, and many other issues. And we know for a fact that business as usual is not going to get us to where we need to go in the mm -hmm. next years. And more and more people are calling for drastic reductions in greenhouse gases over the next five to ten years and things. And we thought, what does that really mean? What do we, what do we really know about transformation, how it comes about and how it can come about in a way that is fair and, um, and sustainable? Um, mm. So a lot of us decided that there were so many different conversations going on about transformation that it was really time to get together, pull together the knowledge base that we have about it and, um, and bring some real critical thinking and creative thinking to the, um, the topic. Cool. So what is a transformation? Well, I think that what we find um, here at the conference is that there's lots of different interpretations of what transformation mm -hmm. is. People are comparing it from incremental to transformative change, but, but or business as usual to transformational change. But I think um, what we really see is that it is a qualitative um, shift in, in the way we look at things. It can be a physical change in the structure, um, things, but it's, it's often a way that, that when we've questioned our assumptions and challenged um, the way that we're doing things right now, that we start to see things in a different way. We start to see different possibilities for solutions, um, concrete practical solutions to environmental and social challenges. Mm. And the format of the conference is a bit different than usual. It's an unconference. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yeah. Well, there's a lot of elements of a conference and then a lot of elements of an unconference because we know that just coming together and watching PowerPoint presentation after PowerPoint presentation can get very tiring and mm -hmm. you always lack the dialogue and discussions or they always yeah. get cut short. So what we wanted to do was to create an arena where all these people can come with different perspectives and not only come with their papers but come with their whole meaning and sense. So we, we've created a lot of spaces um, for like speed papers, fish bowls, open spaces, and, and kind of public dialogues on transformation so that everyone can come and be challenged a little bit, pushed out of their comfort zone and, and really um, you know, bring it together. And we've included the arts in this so that we get just out of our heads sometimes and start to really start feel what transformation mm -hmm. could feel like or look like. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much.